Hey guys, it's Marissa. Um, I know maybe a few of you, maybe a lot of you, I don't know yet, are sort of surprised at my sudden absence from Quizaz. I don't know how to describe it. But um, if you're wondering why you haven't been seeing my profile or anything of that matter, this video is going to hopefully be quick and going to explain it. Um, hmm. I was trying, I don't remember when, I want to say two or three days ago, I'm not too sure. I was trying to update a status and then I was just logged out. So I tried to log back in with my login information and it said incorrect email or password. So my mind instantly turned to, did I change my password? Let me say forgot password. So I went and I clicked uh, forgot password and my hair, Jesus Christ. And when I clicked forgot password, it usually sends you an email, right? So my email is sinistergates69 at uh, yahoo.com and it's hooked up to my little iPod so I'll receive it as like a text notification type of thing. Well, fucking an hour later, I never got it. So I hit it like a thousand more times and I still never got it. So then it kind of occurred to me, okay, either... Somebody fucking hacked me? Or I just got kicked out of Quizass. <laughs> well, I don't think anybody hacked me. I mean, I don't see who would hack me. I mean, just don't. But what I can think of is that I was probably kicked out or reported or they just unanimously said, Hey, it's Marissa. That bitch is the leader. So... After days of literally trying to get on an account, trying to create an account, trying to find an account to use, trying to log into old accounts, logging into friends accounts, thank you Piper, and Brittany, but it's just, it's it's hopeless. I've, I've given up on Kazaz. I've, I'm so done, I'm so pissed off. I lost over 2,000 friends. I lost over 30 stories. I lost so much and I know some people went and dedicated some stories to me on there and I was really I was reading every story that's ever been dedicated to me so to find out now that I can't read them that I can't even log in it pisses me off so bad and I'm so sorry I mean I know a few of our a few of you are thinking oh she left on purpose or da da da, da. no I did it. I know I've been talking about it, but I I left involuntarily. I was kicked out, banned, some bullshit. So I've made like eight different emails. I'm sorry, this monster. I have on two shirts right now, so this isn't working. I've created so many different email accounts and everything, and then I tried to log in with my Facebook. No. <gasps> Well, I still have one more option. I doubt it'll work though, but I've tried to log in with my Facebook. I've tried to log in with my Twitters. Because I think I got two Twitters. So I tried to log in with my Twitters, and then I tried to log in with like my million Google accounts, and it didn't work. So I give up. But, you know, um, I was really about to give up on writing entirely. But, um, why the fuck am I so itchy? damn it um but thinking about it seeing Kristen Stewart stare so sexily at me in the background um like I was saying just thinking about it and thinking about how much I enjoyed writing not only that but reading and talking to you guys it's like oh, I don't want to leave it I don't want to leave it so I'm sorry, I keep messing with my stitches. So. <laughs> so, um. I have decided that I'm going to move over to Miba. Miba. Don't know how to pronounce it. And, like a boss, I wrote it down. See? Miba. Ignore the really ugly handwriting. Miba.com. 
My username is antichrist underscore 666 and y'all should have seen that coming. And if you don't know what the hell I'm trying to say, I'm intelligent and I would have used my red marker but I don't know where it's at. And I'm not allowed to have Sharpies anymore. Poo. Also, honestly, Honestly. Honestly. <gasps> uh, paper. Out of the butt crack. Stop. So, um, yeah. Um, if you already follow me or favorite me or whatever the fuck it is on Meba, Meba, whatever, um, then you would know that the only story... I need to stop itching. That the only story I have on there is his morals aren't so well defined, which is my Matlin story or um, Shadows in Brooklyn Almond. But when I finish that, I plan to write a Johnny Gat story because I'm obsessed with them, and then I plan to do my Avenged Sevenfold stories. Granted, they won't be as good as they were, but damn, pissed that I lost everything. <laughs> Anyways, it's about to rain over here. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if you can see. Ah! Ah! Can you see that? Can you? Can you? Can you see that? Can you see that? Can you see that? It's gonna rain. But um, yeah. Anyways, it's going to rain, so I gotta let you guys go. Hmm. I love you guys and I hope to see you on Miva. So like, yeah. Um Bye.